so today um, I got a really bad sleep again even though I took like um, my knockout pill like a fourth of the pill I can take up to the whole pill but I don't know why I'm just really stressed out and depressed um, so I kind of cheered myself up by going online I have to push myself to go online and then like people are up, some of my people are up at like, some of my friends are up at like 6 or just before 6 o'clock in the morning, so that's always fun. And um, I had some chai tea that I had some spices to. And um, I had some chocolate, some dark chocolate, and listened to Bonder and Bloom um, do much better. <laughs> it's awesome. So when I get interested in a song, like I like play it over and over and over again and that's to kind of cheer myself up and I did some snow shoveling and it's my mom's birthday I actually went out snow shoveling in PJs which my stepdad really hates um, so I kind of snuck out while he was reading the paper in front of him I don't think he noticed um, but it's just one of those things my parents really care about what people think and I try and um, I try and get away with things. I don't really believe in the facade of um, perfection kind of thing. I want people to know who I am a little bit. But at the same time, like this morning when I was really depressed, I was I was trying to vlog. And I kept deleting it because I couldn't, it was like, in my head, I'm like, oh, that's so dumb, that's so dumb, that's so dumb. Because I guess I had, at that time, nothing really good to say. Like, I wanted to kind of wait until I kind of had a little bit of good stuff to say. Because I don't want um, people to get depressed listening to my vlogs. I want you to kind of understand that the struggle um, is really hard and... Um, I don't know why, and I, I don't know why I can't do things. I think a lot of it's fear. Um, another thing that i kind of been afraid to kind of... I was wondering, my weight seems to be going down, and I know I had a really bad cold for a week, and I wasn't really eating too much. It wasn't really that it affected my eating. It's just that's what I was craving. And now that my cold's over and my depression's back, I don't seem to feel like anxious or depressed when I have a cold I told my worker that that was a good thing that I had a cold so I don't have to feel mental um, and she thought that was pretty funny as if she'd never heard that before but I find that's true um, and I have a history of anorexia and I know that I don't feel like I'm going to go back there I'm going out to dinner it's my mom's birthday like I said and I don't care what I eat it's not calories it's just it's just like I'm not thinking of food, you know? Um, I guess also I haven't been feeling like going out shopping because of really depression. I'm just like, um, you know, it's hard. I have food, but the kind of like a lot of vegetables. I like lots of vegetables that are like um, fresh. I don't have a lot of vegetables in my fridge. Um, I don't know. It's just, I'm not, I don't think I'm getting sick. It's it's just hard trying to deal with it. I guess I'm I'm using my sad lamp for the sun, but it's like a sunny day and I've got my head under a pillow like for the last couple of days, just trying to avoid anything like stimulation. And today I'm like, okay, I'm going to go on Twitter and, and talk to my friends and just sit there and stare at the screen and that seems to be working along with the chai tea and the chocolate but somehow I think it's not going to last so I have to uh, think of something else I guess but I'm hoping if I take my sleeping pill tonight again it'll be okay and I'll get a better sleep eventually and just deal with this and maybe talk to my people next week about what's going on again because I don't know something